Valentine's Day, guys. Happy ah. Valentine's Day. It's February the 14th. New video, 3pm, on the Telford Minster Youth YouTube channel. Do you like Valentine's Day? Oh. Do you want the long answer or the short answer? Well, I enjoy... It's, it's, it's a, a good, I think it's nice. It's a nice excuse to buy yeah. a gift or it's, receive yeah. a gift. Okay. <laughs> do you tend to do anything special? Um, probably not on the day, because if you go out for a meal, it's more expensive. Unless you get Marks and Spencer's meal deal. All about that, all about that. Boom, boom. Um, but sometimes we go out. <laughs> so, because it's Valentine's Day literally today, uh, we're going to play a game of Mr and Mrs. Ooh. And so I'm going to ask you a question. We've got some pads of paper and some pens in front of the camera that you can't see. There's ten cards each, ten questions. And so you're going to write down your answer, not looking at the other person's answer. But you're in the way, so... Well, that's helpful. And I'm going to count to three. Three, two, one. And we're going to show the answers to the camera. To get a point, you have to get the same answer. No points, different answers. Okay. And we, okay. We're, we're competing as a team, aren't we? Well, I guess, sort of. Yeah. Okay. So, the first one. Where did you go on your first date? Three, two, one, show the camera. We have got Cafe and we've got Cafe by the River in Chester. Yay. Yay. Nice. How old were you? <laughs> um, you I was, I'd have been 18, you'd have been 19. Yeah. Oh, and what was the verdict? Yeah. The cafe doesn't exist anymore. Um, oh, no, on each other. I mean. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so... I wasn't so sure. And it wasn't like an intentional day afterwards we realised it was definitely a date. Okay. Yourself? Come on, be honest. I mean, it was worth it. I mean, I, carry, I helped carry stuff shopping back afterwards. Oh. Did a food shop, so it clearly has worked out well. Well, that's one point. Uh, okay, next question. What would Steph's favourite meal be? <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, three, two, one. Macaroni cheese. Come on. Come on. How, why was yours longer? Because I did a little picture of macaroni cheese too. Hey. Oh. There's another point. Okay. Question three. Mm. What is Harry's go-to karaoke song? Oh, oh we've talked about this, <laughs> but I can't remember what it is. Three, two, one. We have got. You make my dreams come true, Dowell and Oak. Oh no, that's and not what I've got. Do you want me to explain to it? The to the road to, down under. To the, you know that to get a Vegemite sandwich. Oh yeah. Do you come from a land down under? I do really like that song, but this yeah. is a song that I stand by to say that if one day oh. they made a biopic on my life, uh, the the initial like thing happening at the moment where you see me like getting ready for the day would be to this song. So no Sorry. points. Awkward. Who said I love you first? Three, two, one. Steph? Me. Oh. <laughs> nice. nice. Were you expecting it? No. No. <laughs> and we just watched James Bond, hadn't we? Yeah, with a load of our friends. Very and romantic. I've made it really clear wow. that I never wanted to go out with him. And then... And then I, you said I, I love, love you. you. <laughs> <laughs> and how long after this first date in the cafe was it? Uh, the cafe was... Must have been around October. Okay. And then that was... Um, February half term. Yeah. Yeah. That long. What is Steph's favourite piece of clothing? Oh. Mm. Three, two, one. We've got black onesie, a onesie... Of any sort. Of any sort. So I'll basically an all-in-one. Yeah. Okay, number six. Harry wins the lottery. What's the first thing he spends it on? Oh. Oh. Three. Oh, I'm not ready. Two. Yeah. One. Ah. We have oh, a classic well. car and guitars. Uh, yeah. You <laughs> always say that, that you would, if you had loads of money, you'd buy yourself a classic car. Who was the better student at Chester Uni? Go. <laughs> One again. <laughs> Harry, me. <laughs> I got first. Yeah, but I definitely worked a lot harder than you did. What did you study? <laughs> Drama and theatre studies. What did you study? Theology and religious and studies. And I got first. Steph did not. Oh, no. What celeb would Steph take on a desert island? I really hope we're going to get this one right. Because <laughs> the explanation... 
don't know what you it depends who you put in the same. Okay. Okay, three, two, one. Nope. <laughs> You've got Javier who? Javier oh, Bardem. Yeah. Bardem okay. and Henry. Henry Cavill. They're both big and dishy and a little bit hairy. <laughs> <laughs> Just like me. Where is Steph's dream holiday destination? Three, two, one. Oh. Both wrong. Italy, <laughs> LA. <laughs> Only because we never got to go. We never but, got to go to LA. Um, but Italy, yeah, I would like to go to Italy too. What is the best present Steph has bought Harry? You've bought me some good ones, Steph. I know. Okay, oh. three, two, one. We've got Doc Martens, Doc Martens. I love my Doc Martens. Awesome. That's another point. That's ten questions of Mr. and Mrs. and you guys got five points. <laughs> <laughs> so as it's Valentine's Day, you two are obviously both in love. If we've got any boys or girls who are watching today, it's three o'clock, they've only got a few hours left of Valentine's Day, and they've got someone special in their life, what should they do? What should they go and do? I think you should go and tell them. No. Yeah. The worst thing they could do is say no. Yeah. And if they say no, Take no as the answer. Let no be no. Mm. But, you know, maybe go and take them some chocolates and flowers. Well, thank you for coming with me on this February the 14th. Ooh. Have a good Valentine's Day. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye.